Hey everybody, TNTMP here. We're back today. Going to do a painter review on uh, the Coyote Creek upper shelf natural gold painter from Mike at Gold Nugget Sales. It has a guaranteed one gram bag. See Tom Bompker on there. Uh, another collaboration with uh, with Mike. So yeah, uh, about 15 ounces of pay dirt in here, and a guaranteed one gram of gold. So yeah, we'll uh, break this open and uh, pour it out and see what it looks like and uh, get it classified down. Uh, we'll uh, run the magnet over it and see what kind of magnetics are in this. Uh, this pay dirt comes from the upper shelf or the upper bench uh, along the creeks. Uh, there's a false bedrock, the clay layer, that uh, that the gold comes from. So, <clears throat> yeah, they uh, dig that dig that out and uh, test sample it and test it to see how good it is. And, yeah. I guess it turned out pretty good so yeah we'll give it a shot so yeah stay tuned excited about this one uh this uh pay dirt comes from uh well the coyote creek area of grants pass oregon so all right all right everybody stay tuned and uh we'll be right back all right all right we are back Coyote Creek, the upper shelf, natural gold pay dirt from goldnuggetsales.com. Thank you, Mike. All right. Let's get this opened up. Take a look. Well, let me grab the scissors. All sealed up and all nice and good. Top of the line quality package, man. Tell you what, no leaks, nothing. So you all can see that. I'll pour it out in this tub here. But yeah, there it is. Ooh, I see some gold in there already. Wow. All right. Ooh, there's some clay. Look at that. Bam. Got to make sure I break that up. Oh, yeah. See that? There'll be gold in that. That is sweet. That's a hard rock there. But, yeah, you want to make sure you bust all these, all this clay up. Because your gold will be trapped in that clay. That's a false bedrock down there where they're getting this from. So, yeah, that's a... That even has some, I gotta make sure I, uh, that's a rock there. Sweet. There's some more. Oh, that's a rock, but, oh, that's a rock. Yeah, you, oh, there's some more clay. Yeah, this, uh, oh, what is that? A rock. Wow, look at all the um, interesting rocks. Very cool. Very, very um, <clears throat> uh, mineralized. You can see it's got that reddish tinge to it. Oh, there's a piece of gold right there I saw. Is that another one? Let's 
sweet. I like this material. Alright, Coyote Creek. Very cool. There we go. So there it is. Let's run the magnet over it and see what we get. Not too bad. Look at that. A little bit of magnets, mag magnet, magnetics in there. I can't talk right now. But yeah. Not much at all. So cool. All right, everybody. Just classified down. I guess the first painter bag Mike, Mike had uh, of Coyote Creek was uh, from the bedrock. Uh, this stuff is from the upper shelf in the in the benches of, of the banks. So it's a little bit, it's not the bedrock gold. Try and break up all these little clay bumps and clogs and all that, maybe that breaking up. So make sure you get all the gold out. Yeah. And we'll pan the plus ten too. If I find anything in that I'll uh, show you guys. So alright. Pour this out. Very cool. All right, everybody, there it is. Wow, look how mineralized it is. That's cool. Look at that. Very fine. Yeah. Sweet. So we'll give this a pan too and see if anything's in there. If I find anything in here, I'll show you. But yeah, we'll get started on this. All right, everybody, I'll get set up and uh, be right back. Okay. Got my jet dry here. Work this around, break it up some more. Look how red that is. It's like a dark, chocolatey red, mineralized dirt, clay. Let's give this a quick pan, huh? Yeah, sometimes that clay layer, the false bedrock layer, it can uh, be pretty deep sometimes. I mean, sometimes you can find it a foot down. You know, sometimes it can be 10 feet down, 25, 35 feet down. You never know. Um, the best way to look for it is, uh, you know, walk the banks of the creek and the river. Find the, uh, the ridge lines. 
and see if you see any exposed, uh, you know, exposed uh, rock, river rock that's stuck in the bank that's exposed. And um, yeah, check out the different colorations, and the striations in the uh, in the material that's in the bank, embedded in the bank. <clears throat> Sometimes you'll have that real dark black. Those are mostly organics, like you know, plant material that's decomposed. Usually, there's no gold in that. But you want you want the mineralized, the red or the gray or the blue, you know, color type clay. If you see that, that's a good indicator. Yep. You, know, you want to be, uh, this stuff is uh, real light, so you want to be kind of delicate, not real. Let's just charge through it and, you know, blow your gold out of your pan. When you start seeing it on the edges, you want to bring it back, work it, work it down towards the bottom of the pan in that corner. Kind of drain off the water a little bit and then just very lightly just work the lights out. Give it a tap, 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 tap it down. Get that gold to settle down in that crease. Let's keep working it. And just repeat. For you, all you out there that are new to panning, you know, use a little jet dry. You know, just put a couple drops. It's a surfactant, you know, it'll break up the surface tension so the lighter gold won't float away. It'll just float right out of your pan. It'll make it sink. That's why I use it in uh, even when the, I'm doing the cleanup sluice, you know, you use it so it catches all the fine gold in your mat, in your dream mat, and it keeps it in your pan. All right, we're getting down there. Let's give it a swirl back and see what we get. All right, let's see what we got here. Oh yeah, see there's the black sands. So you can tip it forward, you can swirl it from side to side, but I like like that, you can swirl it like this, but sometimes your gold will just keep swirling, you know, with it. So if you want, just tilt your water forward, bring it back. Tilt it forward, bring it back. See how, see all the lights just kind of come down? It's a good way to do it. Wow, look at it all. 12 to 30 mesh gold here, so it looks nice and chunky. That is sweet. Right on. See, the gold usually stays at the top there, so... I'm going to zoom you guys in a little bit more. Then you can really see what I'm doing here. Wow, look at that.
See how the the material, the ladder material just see how it walks its way back. Look at that. Nice. Nice and chunky. Nice dark color too. Very nice. Nice little piece right there. Right on. There you go. Put that back up in there. See all your stuff's down here. And then your gold is left at the top. Nice stuff. Look at that. All right, everybody, I want to uh, get this snuffed up and do the other half of the, of the pay dirt, and then I'll show you that. So stay tuned. All right. All right, everybody, here's the uh, second half of, uh, of the pan that I just did. Check out this water. Look at that. It's just like a reddish caramel color. <laughs> Anyways, let's give this a spin back. And uh, we'll see what it looks like. Sorry about the glare. But man, you can already see it. I'm gonna try something here. Let's uh, turn that off. Oh, that's a lot better. All right. Wow, look at that. Look at all that shiny. Sweet. So I'm just bouncing the water off the wall of the pan there where the gold is. Just front to back, front to back. So it works all that material down without swirling it. You can give it a few, a few swirls here and there if you want. When the gold's chunky and they're like little pickers, they, it, st it stays in one spot more. But, you know, this ain't bad, this stuff's pretty Decent size, man, I'm impressed. So yeah, there it is. 
Wow, look at all that. That's like a small little nugget on the far left right there. That is sweet. All right, everybody, I'm going to get this snuffed up and uh, dump it all in the pan and show you. So cool. Stay tuned. Be right back. All right, everybody, we're back, and here is the snuffer dump. Look at all that. Wow. Looking good. Look at all that. There's a nugget right there. It's like a little picker. I don't know if I picked it up, but no. Nope. That piece is a nice piece. Wow, look at that. Now that's a picker. Yep, pick it up. Oh yeah, you all hear that? Oh yeah, that's a little picker right there. It's chunky, I can feel it. That's a nice little piece too. Yeah. Yep. So that piece, that's a nice piece. Those two pieces. Then there was a, yeah, this piece right here. That's a nice little piece of wire right there. Look at that. Wow, it's kind of crystal looking. Well, there you go, everybody. The final snuffer dump. So I'll get this dried out and get it on the scale and get a weight for you. So stay tuned. All right, everybody. Got the gold all dried. There it is. So let's get it on the scale. All right, here we go. I'll call it out. Hold on here. My bad, my bad. Sorry, y'all. Helps to tear it out. <laughs> uh, what a rookie mistake. Okay. Tear it out. Let's do it. Point three zero. Oh. Point five eight. Point eight four. Well, it's not the one gram. Maybe my, you know what? I think my my batteries are going a little dead. Um, <clears throat> I know it's been kind of acting up. Maybe that's my problem. Let's do this again. Let's tear it out. Let's start over. Let's turn it off. Turn it back on. That one's 418. That one's a lot heavier. I wonder what the deal is with that. 
Oh yeah, why is it different than uh Ay 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 <clears throat> All right Tear it out See it's acting up Could be the operator There we go. All right, start over. Yeah, 0.85. Hmm. Seems to be a, a, a little shy short there, but that's a, uh, Maybe it's the trays or, see this one's a lot lighter. Let's see what happens here. Yeah, it's about the same. Yeah, it's a little 0.85. So unless I lost some, there might be some in the, I, haven't, I didn't do the plus yet. There might be some in there. So let me pan that out real quick and let's see where we're at. So uh, you all hold on tight. All right, check this out, y'all. I uh, did the plus 10. Yeah. Did the plus 10. Check this out. There it is. Oh yeah, look at that piece. There's the extra that I missed. Yep, that's why I was short. I didn't do the plus 10. But there it is, the big chunky stuff. Look at that. Wow. That's a nice piece there. And all these like th three, four pieces right there. Oh, they're big. Yeah, I see. Um, There's four pieces. Wow. Sweet. Well, let me get those out. And then, uh, yeah, look at those. Let me get those out and get them weighed up. All right, hold on a sec. All right, everybody. Yeah, I found it. It was in the plus 10. And it's actually five nice pieces. Wow. Five nice, really nice pieces. I mean, listen to this. Look at that piece. That's a picker. Look at this. Look at that piece. All nice size. Wow. Here's a nice solid little piece. Solid. Then this last little guy right here. See, so there you go. So let's throw this big one on, see what it weighs. It doesn't really weigh. Okay, I thought it would, but this is 0 0.05. 0 0.11, 0 0.13, 0.16. So then the rest, nice looking stuff, huh? Look at that.
See what it weighs. Right on the nose. There it is. Point one point zero one. Right on. There's my guaranteed gram. Woohoo! Got it. Found it. Yeah. Sweet. Nice chunky stuff. Look at that. Wow. It's a nice piece right there. Another nice piece there. That's a sweet looking piece. Got some wire gold in here too. That's a chunky piece right there. Look at that piece, nice wiry piece there, look at that. It's a nice wire piece there, but yeah, all these are nice pickers right here. You pick these puppies up. Very nice. That's a nice piece right there. Cool. All right, well, I'm happy, found it all. There you go, everybody. Hope you all enjoyed. Sweet, 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 right on. So yeah, cool. All right, thanks, Mike, appreciate it. Uh, Gold Nugget Sales. Yeah, go to his website, check it out, man. Can't go wrong. Really cool stuff. And um, yeah, I'd like to give another shout out to some of my new subscribers I got. Um, to Jade's, at Jade's Adventure. Thank you for subscribing, appreciate it. Uh, I'd like to thank Kim Yi Yong. Thank you for subscribing. And I'd like to thank in new bricks thanks man appreciate it william knoll thank you very much for subscribing and uh lenise lee thank you very much i really appreciate y'all yeah um leave me a comment let me know what you think uh upper shelf uh coyote creek man good pay dirt go get yourself some uh thanks mike appreciate it again uh like always it's always a pleasure so yeah, Coyote Creek, Tom Bompker, Oracle, Oracle of Gold prospecting, prospecting. Man, I can't talk tonight. I don't know what's up. I'm just tired. Whew, man. <laughs> oh, it's been a long week. Um, anyways, it's all right, everybody. Uh, thanks for watching, tuning in. Appreciate it. It was fun. And uh, yeah, uh, hit that subscribe button. Really appreciate it. It helps out the channel. Leave me a comment and hit that like button. Give me a thumbs up, man. I appreciate it. So, all right, everybody. I appreciate you all, and uh, y'all take care, and I will see you all on the next video. All right, everybody. Y'all have a good night.